Hey guys, John V from Phone Arena. I'm live here at CS 2015. I'm doing a quick hands-on look at the studio, the Blue, Blue Studio X Plus. It's a very affordable smartphone, priced at $149, and that's the outright cost. So this is one of the many devices that Blue announced here. So let's jump in, talk about the design. For a phone that's $150, of course, you're not gonna get that much premium qualities to it. It's an all plastic made device, um, but has a matte, you know, matte finish. Almost feels like a soft touch. So does, there's two models available, well, two colors. You have the black and also the white. So they do a nice, they have a nice clean finish with the two of them. Um, being the, uh, since it's packing a 5.5 inch display, you know, it's a little bit more cumbersome to hold in hand, a little bit in the wide side. But for the most part, the design is, what I'd say, conventional, generic. At least it's not, as you know, it's not really cheap feeling. There's a decent amount of substance to it. So look around. On the sides, uh, you have this metal trim. It's like, actually not metal, it's actually plastic. It looks like metal, but it's a silver trim around the sides. You have the, uh, the uh, volume controls here on the left. The bottom is clean. On the right, you have dedicated power button. Up top, you have the 3.5 millimeter headset jack, the micro USB port. Um, and if you look at the, um, the display, now this one here is a 5.5 inch 720p display. More than adequate, you know, it'd be nice to see 1080p, but for the price point, you can still get away reading it. Um, nice, it's, for the most part, I'm pretty surprised by the quality. It's kind of tough to see here, you see it's very reflective, but looking at it from the front, it has a really nice color tone to it. Uh, other things worth noting, um, in the back you have an 8 megapixel camera, while on the, uh, the front you have a 2 megapixel one. It's powered by a uh, by 1.3 gigahertz quad core chip, and uh, you know, it's a GSM, GSM un unlock smartphone, and uh, when it launches here in the US, it's going to be running Android 5.0 uh, Lollipop, right? And this, as you can see here, uh, already running Lollipop. So it's a stock experience from the looks of it. So it's pretty nice that you're getting the most up-to-date Android experience when it launches. All of this priced at only $150. So you get a 5.5 inch display, 720p, 8 megapixel camera. Okay, the, you know, a generic looking smartphone, but for the price point, you can't go wrong with it. So if you guys want to learn more about the Blue Studio X Plus, you can check out our website, phonearena.com. It's John V. Thanks for watching. Exactly.